How to save money by eliminating 10 things you don't need. Check out these relatively painless ways to cut back on your expenses. You will need self-discipline, sacrifice, and open-mindedness. Step one, stop buying unnecessary paper products. Use cloth napkins, mop up spills with dishcloths and rags, write shopping lists on the back of junk mail envelopes, and stick your coupons inside. Step two, give up bottled water. Almost 40% of it comes out of the tap anyway. If you don't like the taste of your local water, use a filter. Step three, buy less food. The average American throws out 25% of the food they buy. Start monitoring what you're trashing so you can make better choices when you shop and make an effort to eat food before it goes bad. Step four, get rid of your home phone if you have a cell phone. Step five, cancel your gym membership. Jogging, stair climbing, jump roping, hula hooping, and dancing are all free. And that's just a partial list of what you can do to stay fit. Canned goods and old milk jugs or detergent bottles filled with water all make good hand weights. Step six, forgo the fast food. If you really have a hankering, recreate the meals at home. All those secret recipes are online. Step seven, drop your cable subscription. More and more television shows are available online, and you can even hook your computer up to your TV set for the ultimate viewing experience. If you're subscribing to cable TV all year just for one or two premium shows, it's cheaper to wait and rent the entire season on DVD. Step eight, put down the new jeans. If you're like the average American, you've already got about eight pairs and wear only two of them anyway. Step nine, don't pay the 100 to 400% markup on jewelry. Buy baubles for yourself and gifts for others at pawn shops and estate sales instead. Step 10, get rid of unnecessary vitamins, unproven supplements, and worthless cleansing or fasting products. Ask your doctor what you should be taking. Did you know? The average American drops $6,881 into vending machines during their lifetime.